Meanwhile Mackenzie admits to Molly that she's on tenterhooks waiting to hear from Levi, but she dares not call him in case he hasn't told his wife the truth yet. Molly convinces her otherwise, and when they do speak, Levi promises he's ending things with Imogen tomorrow, but is at odds with what approach to take. Imogen returns from a conference, sensing her marriage is about to take a turn and tries to distract them both with breakfast, then delays with a shower. Eventually, Levi cuts through though, they need to talk. Tragically, Imogen thinks Levi's problems lie on the subject of having kids, making the truth even more crushing, I'm having an affair, he tells her. And I'm leaving you. Imogen's questions are overwhelming to them both, how long? Who is she? Pack your bags and get out. He's hesitant to leave her upset, cursed with still caring for her, but she's firm, this isn't your home anymore. Finally, Levi comes home to Mac and the lovers embrace. It's sad, but they're together now. At last. Eden answers the phone to a distressed and angry Imogen in the wake of Levi's affair bombshell. She confronts Eden about being his cover story, and Eden admits that's true. But when she protests that she didn't know all along, it falls on deaf ears. It's only when she fronts up in person to declare that she'd also be happy to never see her brother again, Imogen crumbles. Talking through the affair, Eden reveals the other woman to have been Mackenzie, and declares they're no longer friends as a result. While Mackenzie comforts Levi, sorry for everything he's been through, but glad they're together. For his part, he's worried about Imogen, and ignores Mac's advice to leave her be. When she presses, he snaps at her. Don't tell him how to handle his marriage. Once he is calmed, he apologizes to an understanding Mackenzie. It won't always be this way, she tells him. They settle in for dinner when Eden lets herself in with a fierce warning, leave Imogen alone and stop pretending you care. Levi is left feeling even worse, 